Hello friends, how do you hope you are fine? So in this video, I will show you how you can create a complete hospital management system for a single doctor. Okay, so let's start. First of all, you have to open your NetBeans ID. So these are the icons that are required to create a graphical user interface for a doctor. Okay, so you have to copy all these icons because we have to put in the project folder that we have to do. Okay. I simply copy this one and now open your NetBeans ID so it will take some time to start so we have to wait until our NetBeans ID start ok so now you can see our NetBeans ID start ok and what we have to do we have to click on this icon to create a new project ok so select Java and Java application next here you have to name your application h m s and hospital management system l ok and uncheck this one because we don't want to create this main class and it finish Now you can see our hospital management system is project is created. So what we have to do, we have to click it here, okay, and new, and create a J frame form, okay, and name it as login form. Hit next. Now you can see it create a simple form for us so here we can edit and create an interface for our doctor to login through this form and store and process the patient record ok so what i have to do simply i have to copy these icons ok control a control c and open documents net beams project so you can see this one is our project that i recently created here in the src folder okay you have to paste all these icons so open your netbeans and what we have to do we have to take a panel to make a background color white okay so i have to fit this panel to the size of our frame like that you can Take a panel and fit on this frame. Okay. Open properties and background color to white. Close. Okay. Take a label. Properties and change the text like uh, 24 bold and select this one. Engineer Roman, okay, and make color to so I have to change the color. So I have to select this color panel and make it blue like that, okay. HMS okay. I simply name it as hms and login okay close so you can see now i have to take uh, another label okay and drop it here properties and select text uh, null okay so in the icon you have to click here and see there are lot of options so here i have to take the logo so i have to take this logo okay i think it's a little bigger i have to change the small logo okay close so 
you have to set it here like that let me change the size let me view logic so you have to select a big logo here because its size much little larger than this one so properties then i have to select this one okay close And just here, uh, I have to set it here. Okay, you may add your logo here. Okay, let me change the text size because it's a little smaller. 36 is okay. Now I have to adjust its size. Now it's okay. So I have to put a take another label okay. Like this one and I have to put it here. Same like that I have to set a pass icon okay. Uh, key icon here. So I have to select a key icon. To take the password from user to log in to this system okay. And here I have to take a password key. So this one is our password field so i have to drag and drop it here like that and size that just like that okay. properties and heading okay close now i have to take a button to log in okay for login where the user user have to click on this button and we redirect him to login page oh, sorry home page and i have to change the text 24 gold continue running ok and text color is green ok close so you can see our login form is successfully created let me change the size of that no it's ok now when i click on this run button you can see our first page is our login page okay. And it will take some time to run, but you can see it's successfully created. Okay. So our login form is ready. Now I have to simply edit text to null, and I have to change its variable name. Okay, because I have to get this text and compare with my password. So I name it as pass and okay. So our login form is ready, uh, click on login button but one problem is here you can see when I run this program the form is open on the top left corner ok. I wanna open this form in the middle of screen ok. So what I have to do, click on navigations and click on form ok. Form properties, go code okay click code and generate okay generate resize and generate center close when i run this one you can see it open in the middle of screen so here i have to take the password and log in so when i double click on this button you can see or you may go event and 
get x on both plan okay you will be here okay so i have to set the static password here okay? name it as string pass user pass which is equal to 12348 pozp okay so i set this password and when user enter this password he will be redirect to the home. Here I simply add if condition if user pass dot equals user sorry pass dot get text okay. If the user may enter extra space, so we have to remove this space and then compare. Okay, so we have to simply trim this one because if the user may add as one or more space, in it. So if you want like that, you may add trim function. Otherwise, it's okay because may be a space in a password. Okay? So here we simply store this message. Your password is correct. Uh, okay, otherwise we have to display a message for username. So your password is known. Okay. So J option okay. Then uh, show message dialog. Okay. And here I have to show a message. Okay. So in the next video I will show you how you can create a home page Can you run this button and see if I enter a password here like one two three four and eight like I add a random text after that is it you can see it's wrong when I enter a complete password you can see it's correct so this is where you can create a plugin form in java so hope you like this video in the next video I will teach you how you can create the home page and how can we create classes to store the data okay